Community leaders in Fairfax County are making sure history is not forgotten. They are highlighting a troubling time in our nation's history. At the Bull Run Marina in Clifton, there's a new historic marker. It was put up to honor the lives of enslaved people who were buried there. News 4's Corey Smith explains. How important it is for us to be able to properly record and document black history. Three, two, one. At Bull Run Marina, a new marker details an old chapter in Virginia's ugly past. The small parcel of land overlooking the Occoquan Reservoir is the final resting place of five enslaved people. Their names may be lost to history, but their story is not. It can be found on a new interpretive sign installed this weekend, ensuring this piece of our shared history is not forgotten. These are efforts and one step closer in rectifying the wrongs that perpetuated the enslaved Africans here on, in, in the United States. Fairfax County NAACP President Karen Camblin joined state and local leaders and members of the Northern Virginia Regional Park Authority for an unveiling ceremony Saturday. For years, the agency has known there was a grave site near Bull Run, but it wasn't identified until 2020, when ground penetrating radar helped Nova Parks historian Paul McRae solve the mystery. It was a little bit overwhelming that, to know that uh, these people who had never known freedom were buried here and lost, but that we were starting on the process of opening this back up, telling their story. The land most likely belonged to farmer and slave owner John Woodyard. Each grave has field stones at the head and foot, and like other grave sites for enslaved people, the bodies were oriented towards Africa, symbolic of a sort of spiritual homecoming. This is sacred ground. So the African American, um, a generation of my people also, so it was interesting to pay my respect. And it's good that they're being recognized, but um, and and help keep the you know the history of the people that have come before us um, in the public. Guy. And at a time when some would rather bury parts of our shared history, Fairfax County School Board member Karen Keyes Gamara says acknowledging the past in this way can help Virginia chart a more equitable future. While these individuals behind us represent where we have come from, they endured for a reason so that we would have the opportunity to learn and to grow. That was Corey Smith reporting. Now, placing this marker at Bull Run Marina as part of Nova Park's efforts to tell stories from black history. The group has also placed interpretive signs along the Washington and Old Dominion Trail describing the impact the Jim Crow laws had on black travelers.